folks. Just uh, packing up, loading the van up, um, ready for a job today. Pressure washing day today, which you know I love, I'm excited about it, it's my favourite job. Um, so I'm going to finish packing up, um, I had to clear the van out yesterday, um, just to sort out the mounting of equipment that I have, um, give everything a nice tidy out and maintenance. So yeah, uh, I'm going to head to the job now after I finish packing up. Um, yeah, I'll show you the job. Nice one, thank you. Hi guys, Keanu Reeves here. Now I keep getting comments saying why is Keanu Reeves pressure washing? Um, I don't see it, but yeah, maybe it's it's obviously the hair, isn't it? It's peaking off. Uh, definitely need a trim, I think. All uh, right, I'll show you this job anyway. So yeah, I'm all set up, ready to go. I've uh, filled the bin up with water, pressure washers, um, all sorted. So yeah, let's have a look at this job. So uh, I came, this is actually a repeat customer. Um, I cleaned the conservatory roof about a year ago now and the gutter in as well. Um, it was a fun job actually. So they've called me back today to clean all of this. This is actually a bigger job than um, originally first thought. So now I've got to do all that decking as well. Um, this is going to come up wicked. This has not been cleaned in 30 years at least. I mean, the decking is about four months old, so that should be nice and easy, but it's untreated. So basically a quick clean. Uh, so yeah, in total 30 years worth of growth and dirt and grime on some of this. And now I know some parts have gone over um, by themselves with an the electric pressure washer, um, but some of the brickwork and the walls and things like that, uh, yeah, has not been done ever. So let's have a good look. So we've got all of this dirt here. I mean, you can see the growth coming out of the bricks all around here as well. These steps, super old these coping stones and stuff on here incredibly old these should come up really really nice all of that little lantern things on there so we've got all of this area here all of this um was included in the quote but i'm probably going to give this brick wall a quick going over all down here as well so that comes along we've got all of the deck in a cup of tea thank you very much all of this wall down here a uh, nice bit of ivy on the top i think i'll try and save that um, this is probably some of the worst parts here. I mean, this is pretty bad. As always, a few inches worth of moss coming off of this one. So yeah, it's gonna look stunning once done. And then we've also got the front to do. So this is part block paving, part imprinted concrete. So I'll probably have to move all these bins out of the way and all that. And then this, I mean, I think this is the part that they've done themselves more regularly because it doesn't look as bad as the rest of it. Um, but the imprinted concrete down there, if you can see, is very, very green. So, so yeah, that's the job. So I'll get set up now um, and take you along with me. Um, you know, if you're enjoying the video, well, you're not enjoying it yet, I'm just chatting nonsense. But uh, if you do enjoy the video, consider pressing the like button. Um, I think on one of my last videos, it's got, the last pressure washing video I did was 30,000 views, 2,000 likes, which is a mad ratio. So I know you guys love these sorts of jobs. So I'll try and uh, yeah, do more. Nice one, enjoy.
Oh, here comes the rain. It's not going to be a nice day, folks. Folks, I'll uh, bring you back there. Um, so the first sort of main section of the house is done. Just got that really bad part over here to do. So yeah, once that's done, it's relatively easy then to finish up uh, the decking. I've had some issues with the decking. Um, for it being fairly new, the problem is it's untreated wood, so it's just holding. I mean, this was this. I went over this twice, as you probably saw in the video. Um, you know, it's just holding it. It's not coming out now. This decking's only four months old, so I don't want to be getting too close to that stripping the wood off you know it's brand new so um, what I'm going to do is when I come back to resand this job I'm gonna put some biocide down onto the decking just completely treat it with that um, give it a good soak um, while I'm resanding the uh, block paving and then I'll leave it then sort of a week couple of weeks see how it's looking come back and pressure wash it or it might even just completely sort itself out like that um, but yeah I think the biocide is the only way really on this um, there's probably some other methods but I'm not a decking expert to be honest with you um i just you know clean it and usually it comes up really nice but yeah this stuff it's just holding all of that green really deep down in it so yeah i don't want to damage it so come back chemically treat it and then uh yeah follow up and uh, pressure wash it again it will come off a lot easier after the biocide's killed off all the growth on it anyway so uh this part's looking up nice drying out really nicely i mean look at the color of that so there's you know dry bricks right there keep that in your head let's have a look at this same bricks, look at the colour, so yeah, really, really nice difference. Um, as you probably saw, these brick walls here come up really, really nice. There's still some staining on it. If need be, I'll put some bleach on it. Um, try and get some of the black off, but the bricks came up lovely, 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 lovely. Um, yeah, a lot of cement on this bit as well. I think it's cement. It doesn't look like efflorescence to me. That's like, yeah, it's hard, that's cement. So yeah, I can't really be getting that off, to be honest with you. I probably need some brick acid or something. Um, yeah, apart from that, all looking good. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna clean this, but not properly clean it. I'm basically just gonna rinse all the dirt off, but I'm just gonna wait till I do this bit. So I'll clean all that down, and then I'll rinse all of the decking off, try and make it presentable, and then crack on. Um, it's lunchtime now, so I've been quite slow, to be honest with you. So I'm gonna have some lunch, and then uh, yeah, get cracking on that bit in the front. Nice one.
Right then folks, did it, all done. Uh, time's 4.20, blaze it. Uh, no need for any bleach, I was gonna put some bleach on it, um, but to be honest, there's no need, there's no black spots, nothing like that, so pointless using chemicals if you don't have to. Um, I'll walk you through the job now, show you the final results, but yeah, I'm very, very pleased with it. So here's the area we started on today, that just stays where because that tap drips forever when it's on. But as you can see, lovely colour difference, I'll try putting a before as well. Um, I'm really impressed with these steps, the steps all came up lovely, again, cement and stuff on the side, not really much I can do. Um, so yeah, that came up all really, really nice. Coping stones looking a lot brighter, and a lot neater as well, I was going to bleach them, but again, it wasn't part of the original thing, so if, if I can do a job without having to suit up and get chemicals, all over the place and near plants and stuff in the garden you know unless it's asked specifically i don't see the point in doing it um but that's just my opinion um these brick walls here came up lovely tried to uh, not harm the ivy too much as well that came up really nice really really nice difference there this bits are still a bit damp actually a few puddles but that will drain away and this was the most weediest part as well. This is where all that really thick moss was. So we come out here. Still very wet round here. But this looks uh, almost brand new to be honest with you. Look at that. Oh yeah, you're right. How's it going? Yeah, all done now. All right, I'll uh, just finish doing my little filming and then um, I'll pack up. No, no, that's all right. And then I'll pa pack up and then I'll be on my way. So yeah, the block paving parts there came up perfectly. There was a few stains on the imprinted concrete. Um, like I'll show you down here. Rust. So something's done that. Um, again, I'll uh, talk about it with the customer. If they want something done about it, I'll see what can be done. Um, but it's no, no major issue, I don't think. But uh, yeah, there we are. So I'll just finish packing up now. So thanks for watching everybody. If you enjoyed, hit like, hit subscribe if you want to. Um, I've got a few pressure motion a few pressure washing jobs on this week so I will um I'll be back with quite a few videos hopefully anyway um the weather's meant to be a bit dodge but so as long as the weather's nice then uh, yeah we're all good to go so yeah I'll probably see you in the next probably tomorrow or the day after peace thank you